Okay, today I'm going to demonstrate for you the Mu of the Shoe Lab. The purpose of this lab was to demonstrate and show you the coefficient of friction. The symbol for the coefficient of friction is the Greek letter Mu, so that's why we call it the Mu of the Shoe Lab. So for this lab, the students had to take off one of their shoes, and the first thing they had to do was use one of three force gauges, depending on the weight of their shoe, you had everything from a 5 Newton gauge here. This one was 10 in the middle, and for the really heavy shoes, you had a 30. My shoe does well with the 10, so I'm going to go ahead and weigh my shoe with the 10 and record the weight of the shoe on a data table. Hopefully you can see here that the weight of my shoe is right around 4.6 Newtons. We'll talk about the data table in another video and how the data goes on there and the calculations there. Um, after they weighed the shoe, the students then set the shoe on the surface of the lab table and they hooked the scale to the back of the shoe and then they just drug the shoe across the lab table and observed the reading on the scale and then recorded that on their data table as the force friction. Next they took a one kilogram weight which weighs 9.8 newtons, put it in the shoe and then repeated the process of dragging the shoe across the lab table and recorded the friction on the uh, recorded on the scale and they would have observed that this is a higher friction due to the added weight of the one kilogram weight and then last in this lab they put the shoe on a different surface in this case a wood surface and we drug it across there and again taking note of the friction on the gauge and recording that on the lab table so that is a brief demonstration of the lab um, look for the video on the data table and I look forward to seeing you in class.